Uh, well, you know, it's always good when you can conclude your season, um, your regular season at home with a, with a win. We've been fortunate enough. We've done that. Um, Golly, we've done that for a couple of years now in a row, more in a row, more than two, I believe. Such a special moment playing at Falcon Stadium with uh, all the seniors and getting our last win at, at, for the Falcon Nation at Falcon Stadium was just a huge moment for us. Yeah, I, I think I'm just I'm thankful to to be out there, be in a position where my teammates trust me to make those plays. Um, obviously, I haven't had the best best luck with staying on the field, so uh, it means a lot for me to be able to finish the season with my guys. And I mean, obviously, we have one more, but finish the season at Falcon Stadium at least. Um, meant the world to me, and just to just to be a part of these moments. These are the ones you you remember. You don't remember a play you made. You remember doing the Ochilele in the locker room with all the guys after. It's pretty nice. I you know last year we lost to Wyoming, and I think that did that put us out of bowl eligibility? Mm -hmm. Yeah, last year we lost to Wyoming. That really hurt because we went down there and we was on the last drive. I think the defense is out out, and we had to finish the game. And this time we actually finished the game, and it was it's it's a great feeling to be ten and two. Uh, every week we say win the week, win the week, but you know now we don't know who we're gonna play or what's gonna happen. So, you know we're gonna take this week to look back at our accomplishments and what we did, and still know that we have another game left. The tipped interceptions, you know, is that something the defense takes pride in, just getting to the ball <laughs> and making opportunities? Oh yeah, that's that's hustle. That's because um, just. We were told earlier this week that the quarterback throws the ball really hard, and there's times where the ball bounces off the receiver's hands, and we just had to make sure we hustled to it and Fedge hustled to it, and he made a play. It's always good when you can make a big play like that for the team, but I was saying earlier, I, I didn't really have to do much for that. The, my teammates kind of did everything for me. He just tipped it up, and I didn't really have to do much. So. And those are your first of the year, right? <laughs> yes. Were you, were you pretty hungry for that? Yeah, I was very hungry for those. You play a grinded out game and then to be able to finish it with a with a long strike like that. What? Um, I don't know. It's just stuff we work on in practice every week, every week and uh, especially this week because we saw a look that they gave to us last year in like the same situation. And uh, we called the play and Ben got open and I gave it to him. Uh, I mean, we both kind of came to the sideline and begging for it to begging for it to happen just because their safeties were rolled down and playing outside and um, we were able to execute. DJ threw a perfect ball and they were the blocking was outstanding. So it was fun. And what has this been like? I mean, that's what seven touchdowns for you on 20 catches, you know, and something like that. Yeah. I mean, it just keeps seems to keep happening. <laughs> like, yeah, it's been a blast. It's been awesome. I mean, end of the day, we just need to keep winning games and we got one left uh, and we got to we got to execute that one. But I mean, end of the day, I'm just glad that we got the win. I was thinking about it like this week. I was like, man, I really love the guys we're playing with and just putting out for them and just playing as a team that made every win special and every game special.